Hi everybody, it's Faith from Fireside Tarot. I hope everyone is well. Well, it's a new year and we're getting back in the saddle here around Fireside Tarot. So it's time to bring back an old favorite. This is the work week top and bottom of the deck reading. <laughs> For those of you who are new here and don't know how we do this, I go by the elements. It is Capricorn season. Capricorn is an earth element. So we will start with the earth signs, go around the wheel accordingly. If it resonates with your sun sign, so be it. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given to by the cards. If you choose to do anything at all, it's your journey, not mine. I'm just reading the cards. If it does not resonate with your sun sign, you can check your moon rising or Venus sign reading. See if it'll resonate a little bit better. If you're not sure where those signs fall as far as the elements go, I will shout the signs out as we go along. Just keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid. All things can and maybe vice versa might play out from the perspective of a cross watcher and our dear friends the cross watchers are always welcome here at the fire sign tarot table. Also, another brief reminder, if it's not resonating with you, leave the cards on the table and walk away. Yeah. Don't take with you what doesn't belong to you because that's how fights get started. Okay. Let's get it going. Earth signs, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. And same old stuff, different week. I never remember to check the calendar to see what dates I'm working with. Tomorrow is the 4th of January. This will be good the 4th through the 8th, okay? Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, January 4th through the 8th. Top of the deck, bottom of the deck, Three of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. Hmm. Could be a family reunion. Could be the reading of a will. I don't know. It doesn't look that dismal. It's togetherness. Something to do with family, possibly. Home. Abundance. Could be a work gathering. Could be going to a meeting. I don't know. In regards to love, well, hmm. Could be a unity coming together. It's a hard one to say. I'll throw a clarifier on it here in a second. I'm not going to beat a dead horse. In the past, we have the Prince of Pentacles reversed and the Princess of Swords reversed. Well, y'all weren't talking, I'll give you that. Maybe that's why you're coming back together now. Mm, nope. No communication going on whatsoever. If there was communication, it was few and far between, stagnant, hey, hi, how you doing, stuff like that. Like, if you see them in the grocery store, you go the other way on purpose kind of stuff. Fast forward a little bit. King of Swords upright, Prince of Cups upright. This is where you're at now. Possibly some truths coming out. Hmm. Somebody could have come back to apologize, maybe. Hmm. Okay. Well, what's going on this week? King of Pentacles in the reverse, death in the reverse. Uh, you know what? Um, something good might come out of this little reunion. I am seeing same old stuff, different day. Not much has changed. That's what I'm seeing. Universe, Source, and Spirit. Can I get a couple cards of clarity on the table? For our Earth sign friends, please, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Just a couple cards. Can I get one on this Three of Cups, Ten of Pentacles? Just one. Just one for the overall, please. Tower reversed. Something trying to rebuild a tower, bring the family back together, maybe. 
Possibly. One card for the Prince of Pentacles, Princess, Princess of Swords reversed. That's the Prince and the Princess. So yeah, that's definitely no communication going on or a cutoff in communication. One card, please. Page of Pentacles. One more. I'm drinking my water. Buddy and I at work are going on this keto diet to see who can lose the most weight over the next year. He's probably going to beat me because, yeah. Um, <laughs> asking me to go without carbs is like asking me to go without air, to be honest with you. We'll see how it goes. I'm just doing it to support a friend. I need one more on this page of pentacles, please. Four of Swords reversed restless energy. Something to do with a small offer. Something to do with another earth sign person. Possibly air sign. Someone may have been restless over a decision someone else made. That's what I'm catching off of that. Seven of Cups. Hmm. Yeah. Families be like that sometimes if this is a family situation. People be like that sometimes if this is a love situation. So. Why is the King of Swords Prince of Cups here? Real quick. Real quick. Ooh, two fell out. Ace of Cups reversed. Ace of Pentacles upright. <clears throat> One more. I keep hearing this as something to do with money. This this coming together, it's not about love, it's about money. One more. And I'm hearing somebody's not over it. Somebody's not over it. Somebody hasn't healed from this. Somebody's not over it. Five of five of pentacles. Somebody's still very much out in the cold with this. Hanging on to that last hope. Like those five pentacles are hanging on to that tree. Hanging on to that last little bit of hope. Hope for this family, maybe? I don't know. Hmm. Super weird, Earth Signs. I don't know where this is coming from. I don't know who this is for, but if it's for you, let me know. Why is the uh, King of Pentacles reversed here in the death card here? Why the King of Pentacles reverse death reverse? High Priestess. Emperor. One more. Something about divine intervention, elders looking on fondly.
Devil Upright Magician Reverse. Someone pulling strings. Someone trying to be manipulative. Someone trying to manipulate the situation. Possibly an elder. But things were not as they seemed and nothing has changed. I don't know who this is for. This is just what I'm hearing. I'm hearing go with your gut. High Priestess, go with your gut. What's your gut telling you? Again, I don't know who this is for, but this is super strange. Let's get some advice. <clears throat> I guess if you are an earth sign person and you're having family issues right now, um, this is your reading. Nine of Swords reversed and the moon. There's a lot left to be re revealed here. Don't lose sleep over it. This is not something for you to lose sleep over. <clears throat> Nine of Cups reversed, Eight of Swords is a knocking cards all over the place. Don't. <clears throat> Don't go drowning your sorrows and don't be all up in your head about it. Don't allow it to consume you. Okay, let me know if that resonated with anybody, all right? That was, to say the least, <clears throat> engaging. It was very soap opera. <clears throat> Pardon me, I got a little bit of a frog in my throat. super tired but super excited because I'm glad that somehow I was able to beat what was physically and mentally and emotionally going on with me over the last couple of months and we're getting back in the saddle and we're riding on. I like it. Um, air. Gemini Libra Aquarius. Someone rising Venus. Those are mixed up. There we go. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, January 4th through the 8th, 2021. I still can't get used to saying it. 2021. Can't get used to saying it. But we're only a couple of days in. It usually takes the average person about three weeks to get used to saying the date. So, okay. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Ten of Pentacles, High Priestess, Reversed. Is this all going to be like about money and family this week? I mean, we did just get through like the holiday season. So a, a lot of you possibly could have been around family. And I know we, sometimes when we're around family, I, I, well, there's a reason why I don't talk to most of my family. So I'll just, I'll put it to you that way. Um, could have been a disconnect in a family situation. Could still be one in progress. I'm hearing somebody's got an ego problem, Gemini. Could have been you. Could have been the other person. All right. Top and bottom. Judgment upright. King of Cups upright. There's a great deal of emotion involved here. I'm hearing something about emotions coming back. Emotions being resurrected. Not sure if they're good or bad yet. We'll throw a clarifier on it. What happened after that? Magician and the Eight of Swords. Along with the resurrected emotions. Could have been an Aries. I mean, to me, the magician represents all the cardinal signs. So Aries. Hold on, stop. I gotta think. Aries, Cancer. Give me a second. I know I'm terrible. Capricorn. Yeah, 
This is terrible. I'm like brain dead right now. <laughs> Aries, Taurus, Gemini, Cancer, Leo, Virgo, Libra. <laughs> it would come to me in just a second. Something consuming. All I keep hearing is why you got to bring that up again. Why you got to bring that up again. We'll throw a clarifier on it in a second. My intuition is like on high right now. I don't know what I'm trying to tune into, but we're working through it. Okay. Oh, that's a heck of a way to lose an argument. Five of swords reversed. Five of Wands upright. I'm not losing this argument. Wow, feuds, feuds, feuds. Holy Moses. What y'all be fighting about? Okay. Universe, source, and spirit. Can I get some clarity in the cards on the table for my air sign friends, please? Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. What? What's with this Ten of Pentacles, High Priestess, reversed? Healing a family issue? Maybe somebody took it up with God? Somebody's been praying over this family issue? Maybe it was you. Why is judgment and king of cups up here? Why judgment and the king of cups? Eight of Cups, old emotions resurrected, and deep emotions. Somebody walked away. One more. The world, the fool. Somebody walked away in a big hurry. I think somebody walked away in a big hurry. to end something. Something had to come to an end and there's one way, to, one way to end it. Somebody had to walk away. And I think could have been the recent past. Could have been the distant past. Something got drudged up. The fool can represent a child or a young person. So something could have gotten something with the kids. Something with the kids. The fool in the world next to each other. Possibly a kid turning into an adult. Going through that cycle change. You get what I'm saying. Young adults. Doggone kids, let me tell you. Hmm. Okay. Why is the magician and the eight of swords here for what's happening right now? Queen of Swords. Oh, we love it when she comes out. Five of Wands again. And the Magician. Why not? Some massive truths coming out in like a family feud style kind of way. And I don't mean the gentle game show kind. I mean, there'll be fighting. Oh, 
Hard to say who started the argument, but mm, I think an air sign had something to do with finishing it. Queen of Swords. This ends now. One more on that. It gave me three. Queen of Cups reversed, Ten of Wands reversed, Four of Wands upright. <clears throat> yeah, by the looks of things, trying to bring this family together only made it worse. I don't know. I don't know. It's all about family issues tonight. Things need to come off people's chests. Things, emotions being repressed. Why the Four of Wands? Page of Pentacles. The only thing that's going to bring this together is apologies. Apologies. Okay. What's coming up? Why the Five of Swords reversed Five of Wands upright? Ace of Wands. It was upright when I saw it. We'll take it upright. That chariot literally turned itself around right on the table. Eight of Wands. Communication, possibly closing a distance gap. Um, I don't know. Maybe you're fighting over FaceTime. I don't know. I definitely see a trying make trying to make it better only makes it worse. Communication. One more. Well, page of wands, that's promising. That's promising because that is to me things at least going in a positive direction. Shadow side. It was just looking so good too. You guys gotta like get through some toxic family energy here. What I'm hearing is I'm taking back what's mine. I'm taking back what's mine. I don't, I don't know what that means. I don't know who that's for. I don't know what that means. Wow. Let's get your advice, air, air signs, because uh. Wow, this is giving me a headache. <sighs> Hanged man upright, full reversed. I'm hearing it's time to accept the fate of the situation and stop acting childish. I don't know who's acting childish. Somebody in this situation could be acting in a childish manner. If it's you, stop it. I don't think it's you, though. Five of Cups reversed, Nine of Wands reversed. I'm hearing stop pouring salt in the wound. Don't pour salt in other people's old wounds. So stop instigating the argument. I don't know what that means. I'm sorry, this is so case-specific. I'm just... I'm reading cards, guys. I'm reading cards. Obviously, somebody needs to hear this tonight, so. 
I do what I'm compelled to do. I say what I'm compelled to say. It's it's part of being an intuitive reader, I guess. Maybe I've just had way too much coffee today. I really don't know. Okay. Water and fire. And then I'm going to call it a night. Because my Mondays still start very early in the morning. Okay. Water, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. January 4th through the 8th, 2021. 2021. was my hair. That kind of hurt. Will of Fortune and the Devil. Could be Capricorn you're dealing with. Could be trying to disconnect from some toxic energy. Could be something that's binding you. Could be karmic with the Wheel of Fortune. Could be any of the fixed zodiac signs associated with this. So... Leo. Scorpio. Taurus. Aquarius. Yeah, I remember them all. It's coming back to me. <laughs> it's coming back to me. All right. What happened? Three of swords reversed, eight of cups reversed. Getting through a state of heartbreak. Possible return. Oh. Oh, well... I mean, there is a devil card in the Wheel of Fortune up there, so I shouldn't be surprised. What happened after that? Six of Wands and Death. Oh boy. Oh boy. Some returning, some returning victorious. It could be a Scorpio, could be a Leo. And after that, I'm going to shut up until I clarify what's happening this week. Queen of Cups reverse, Three of Wands. Someone closing off emotions, someone waiting around. Okay. Universe, Source, and Spirit. Can I get some clarity on the cards on the table for my water sign friends, please? Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, and Venus. Emperor reversed. That didn't go so well, did it? I don't think that went well at all. No. Some will possibly get a little bit out of control. Things could be a little bit out of control. Could be in areas you're dealing with. Or disconnecting from that one showed itself. That's card gibberish. Eight of Swords. Someone's consumed by it. All up in your head about it. Guess what? You really are all in your head. Your feet are not bound. You can probably wiggle out of those ropes. They look pretty loose and once you wiggle out of the ropes, you can totally take the blindfold off and see things as they actually are. You made that cage yourself. Just saying. 
Why is the Three of Swords, Eight of Cups reversed here? <clears throat> Fool reversed. World reversed. There is unfinished business with this person, but you don't trust them any farther than you can throw them because they broke your heart. Could have come back trying to put a Band-Aid on it or they're trying to put a Band-Aid of their own on. You don't trust them. Gosh, I hate it when people do that. Okay. One more on that. Chariot reversed. Come back, come back, come back. All right. Somebody tries to tried to close a gap. Somebody tried to lessen the distance, or they traveled from far. I don't know. Why is the six of wands and death here? Seven of Pentacles. Oh, wow. They waited a minute, didn't they? One more. Four of Swords reversed. Restless energy. I dropped you. I'm going to look at them anyway. Seven of Cups reversed. King of Cups reversed. We'll see if they come back out. Six of Cups reversed, Six of Pentacles reversed. Okay. That could be why somebody's restless because there's definitely some salty feelings associated with this, like in a bad way. I don't think you're happy about this return. Four of Swords reversed, Eight of Swords upright, Restless Energy. Yet yeah, you're not thrilled. You are not giving the same emotions or the same energy to this than they are. Six Pentacles reversed. You, you're not thrilled. I think you could really care less if, if you even feel anything at all. <laughs> Why is the Queen of Cups reversed? Three of Wands here. Oh my, not, not only is there like um, an emotional closing off coming up, it's a, uh, I, I don't care what you have to offer me because I don't want it. That's what I'm hearing. That's what I'm hearing. I don't trust you any further than I can throw you. I don't care if we have, you think we have unfinished business. I don't want what you're offering. Why is the three of wands here? I am hearing the other person involved in this um I'll wait forever um because their ego was like you know what I'm worth waiting for yeah yeah you're dealing with somebody with a huge overblown ego 
like out of control. Emperor reversed, high priestess reversed, three of wands. I'm sensing a very huge overblown ego. And they're they're just gonna wait forever for for you to come around. And I quite frankly, water sign friends, I don't see you coming around because I think they've burned you one too many times. Let's let's get some advice for you. I mean, do whatever you want. It's not my journey. I'm just reading cards. That's just what I'm seeing. Eight of Pentacles upright, five of cups upright. Before you put an ounce of energy or resources into this, I'm hearing remember the three spilled cups. Sorry, Eight of Pentacles, Five of Cups. Remember the three spilled cups. There's still two very full cups of blessings behind you, but you need to remember the three that got kicked over. I mean, I, I that sounds like a lack of forgiveness to me. Do what you want. I'm, I'm just reading cards. I'm just reading cards. Three of Wands reversed in the Queen of Pentacles. I gotta throw another one on that. Just to make sure I'm, I'm hearing correctly. Four of Cups separate Magician Reverse. Remember the three spilled cups? Remember those three cups? Yes, they're trying to hand you a, another, uh, another fourth one, but you know what's in the three already because you've already played this cup game with them before. And if they're, if you even think for one second that they're pulling strings and they're trying to manipulate you, you're worth more than this. You're worth more than this. Um, don't stand at the dock and wait for them to change because you're worth more than this. Okay. All right. Water sign friends. Let me know if it resonated. Oof. Oof. Fire signs. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. What's going on with my fire sign, friends? From January 4th to the 8th. Really? Really? There we go. Hey, now. I gotta shuffle them one more time now. Because these cards really want to play. Fire signs don't like going last, apparently. Just, just, I'm just saying. They don't like going last. Eight of Cups reversed, Ace of Swords reversed. <laughs> wow, another not too perceptive to the idea of a return. Let's throw a clarifier on that in a second. What happened? Six of Pentacles, reverse Nine of Cups. That tells me that somebody put everything they had into this, into making the other person happy and filling the other person's cups and didn't get anything in return or didn't get the same amount in return. That's what that's telling me. Two 
Two of Swords, Upright, Five of Swords, Reversed. Mm. A very painful decision had to be made. A decision that was not taken lightly. Somebody... Mm, I mean, the Five of Swords in the, is in the reverse, but somebody got the short end of the deal. Um, I think somebody left that battlefield definitely not a happy camper at all. Or in this instance, somebody walked away from that dark alley. Not, not at all satisfied. Okay. Coming in this week. Temperance and death. Well, I mean, that's not terrible. Not at all. That well, tempered Sagittarius. That's your card. Um, relating a little bit better, possibly. Patience, more positive energy flow. Sitting next to the death card, definitely like spiritual transformation, possibly. Whatever this is definitely caused a change in the other person. Okay, let's get some clarity. Universe, Source, and Spirit. Can I get some clarity in the cards and the table for my fire sign? Friends, please. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. January 4th through the 8th, 2021. It's hard to say, isn't it? It's weird. It's still weird. It's only like the 3rd of January right now, so... I hope it won't be weird for long. Do, do, do. Wow. I'm going to throw another one on that just to make sure. That's like the doors opening. There's definitely a connection here. The connection is definitely mutual. Why y'all ain't talking, I don't know. Somebody's still emotionally closed off. That's why y'all ain't talking. Someone's ignoring the connection. Well, okay. But, you know, we're dealing with a connection where someone gave it everything and the other person gave it little to nothing. So, why is the Six of Pentacles reversed? Nine of Cups up right here. You want to talk. And you want to talk. The Page of Swords brings messages of truth. And sometimes he brings us messages that we don't want to hear. And I think fi things finally came to a head and someone finally said, you know what, I'm not happy. That sucks. But, throw one more on that. Six of Cups, Cadillac seats way back, guys. Mmm, that's tough. That hurts my soul. It does. Wow. Okay, well. Why is the two of swords upright, five of swords reversed here? Okay, and it lands inverted. Six of Wands. 
reversed. One more. Told you somebody wasn't walking on. Somebody was walking off that battlefield, not a happy camper. Don't know if it was you or them. Nine of Pentacles. This is now energy. This is now energy. Someone's emotionally closed off, potentially because they've come into their own and fire signs. I think this is you. You know what? Uh, I'm good. I, I got nine pentacles. Um, I'm fabulous. I'm successful. I don't need you. I don't need to be in a connection where I, I give it everything and I get nothing. And, sorry, fire signs are blunt enough to say that. And I'll be the first one to admit that we are like blunt as a brick enough to say that. Wow. Okay. Woof. One more on that. Knocking the wind out of somebody's sails, you are, you are. And I don't think you, uh, you really thought too long and hard about that response. And I think in the moment, Seven of Wands reverse, Temperance reverse, there was some negative energy. And it, okay, present energy, it, you know, could have been like a day ago, could be a day from now. It's around now. But I think once things settle down, temperance and death, why are temperance and death here? Oh, wow, hi. Nine of Cups. Upright, even. Wow. Knight of Cups. Seven of Cups. It's a whole lot of cups. I hate it when they land sideways like that. It's a little bit more tipped inverted, so we're going to take it. We're going to take it inverted. Okay. I see a definite change coming in this person. <clears throat> I got your tenth cup. It's right here. And I get seven other cups of options over here. And wind coming out of somebody's sails, but at least at the end of the day, you're going to relate a little bit better and you're going to cause a genuine change in the person that you're dealing with. And sometime, and I hate to say it like this, but it, it's my blunt as a brick thing that I got going on here. Sometimes you have to have the honest conversation with someone for them to realize that they were wrong. I mean, it is what it is, but... It's not my journey. It's not my journey. I'm just throwing down cards. I'm just reading cards, guys. This is what I do. It's your advice. Lovers in the world. Lovers reversed. Wheel of Fortune reversed. I better pull another one down. Eight of Swords reversed. Three of Wands reversed. This is telling me right here, and I don't know if this is for the cross watcher or for the fire sign, but if there is unfinished business to be had, it will be done in due course. Don't sit around waiting at the edge of the dock and being all wrapped up in your head about it. If it's meant to be, it will be. If it is not meant to be, it will not be. Don't wait. 
to live your life. Go forward on the path. The world and the King of Cups process the emotion and allow the cycle to close out. Let nature take its course. If it is meant to be, it will be. If it is not, it will not. End of story. Okay, friends. It's pretty late on a Sunday night. I have to get up pretty early in the morning. I hope you guys enjoyed your reads. I am so glad that I'm feeling better and that I am back. And I'm going to say it one more time. 2021 is going to be Fireside and Tarot's year. Okay. I love you guys. Be blessed. Have a great week. January reads will start on Tuesday. And I will see everybody probably Thursday night or Friday morning for the weekend. Top and bottom of the deck. Love ya. Miss ya. Catch you later. <laughs>